What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Katie, and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> I hate how you're looking at the camera. <laughs> Guys, Alex is behind the camera right now. Say hi, Alex. Hey. <laughs> so, today, I, as you guys can see, I am not in Miss Brittany. If you guys don't know who Brittany is, Brittany is my little... Beep beep Tesla um and I filmed a car tour with her I think like a year ago around this time so you may or may not have been able to tell by the title I have got a new car um I'm in her right now and I wanted to film a car tour for you guys to show you and yeah here we are so I got the car a little bit ago the reason I wanted a new car and I still have Miss Tesla guys I'm not gonna dive too deep and start tearing up now but um it's because my parents are moving and I kind of wanted a gas car so I wouldn't have to like add hours to the trip when I drive to them and this is also my dream car <laughs> so it's amazing and I love it and I'm gonna cry so we're gonna get into this video I guess we're gonna step outside first I'll show you guys the car I will say that I got it wrapped so I'll, I'll put a picture right here of what it looked like before um and I'll also put clips in this video of it getting wrapped at West Coast so let's go outside let's look at the car and let's start this little car tour <laughs> Let's turn her on. Uh, it is not on automatically like the Tesla, I will say. So I do get a little confused. It took me a while to figure out the car. My favorite part of the car we're gonna do first, guys, is Miss Ma'am right here because I have always wanted a sunroof. My very first car didn't have a sunroof. This one I will show goes, goes, what's happening back there? All the way back. It kind of feels like we're in the Tesla in a way, and then it opens up until the, the middle part. So this is kind of like the same vibe my mom has. I really like it. Um, so here she is, a sunroof, guys. Great for vibing down the Santa Monica Pacific Coast Highway. Yeah, that's my, I want to say my favorite feature. And now to get into the aspects of the car. As we see here, guys, we have a great, great, nice control panel. Very touchscreen, very similar to the Tesla. I actually don't even know what all of these buttons do yet. <gasps> I'm still figuring it out. This is very new for me. So, of course, like climates right here. We have their seats, which allows you, you know, I really, I I don't know <laughs> vehicle per se there is different this thing this car guys has different modes so there's sport mode eco mode like off-roading um which i will not be doing but there's a whole bunch of stuff the little knobs here my favorite other favorite part of this car that i really like hi stella is um it has cooling seats i have never been in a car that has had cooling seats but you like push it and you can either do cooling or heating of course but like cooling it makes you feel like there's like a breeze going up your hoo-ha and it <laughs> that's the best way to explain it it feels great honestly so that i do like about the car we have this thing here you know instead of up here the amount of times i tell you guys that i have tried to park the car by pushing the window wiper 
too many times. These are more off-roading kind of knob things. We have Miss Keys right here. And then we have a cup holder. And under the cup holder is some space. So in here I keep, oh, I keep pepper spray, you know, just in case. Gotta be cautious. And then I keep, I actually did not know I had these in here, so. Mints and gum, always. And then of course, Advil because I get headaches like no other so that's what I like to keep in that little compartment I do wish that the compartment was like right here. It's a little easier access You can't like open it up if there's cups in it, but you know, that's like Why am I complaining about that? So this little thing right here where you would usually think has Storage no, it doesn't have storage guys. It has little chargers of course and then right here is a freezer fridge so yeah, it's cold in there. I guess like I don't need that on, <laughs> but I have not used it. You could store a couple iced teas in there, a couple soda cans for the road, you know, toss it back. Um, but a freezer, fridge, it is very peculiar, I will say. I have never been in a car that has a fridge compartment, but when I told a few people about it, they seemed very um, like it was an average thing. And I was like, no. Like, what car do you know has a freezer or fridge in it? I don't know. I've never been in one per se, but yeah, for some reason, that. If you want to keep something cool, I guess, there you go. I mean, it, it is it is handy being a black car and stuff, but you know, will I, will I use it on the daily? Probably not. Now the screen. <laughs> no how to work it there's just loads of things like camera they do have valet mode which they have in the tesla and i love it so people can't like steal your contacts stuff like that and then apple carplay which i am obsessed with we'll plug her in just to show you i mean i'm sure you guys know what apple carplay is we have the music the phone the everything pretty simple it has your apps and stuff like that so i do like this because it gives me like vibes of the Tesla computer screen where you can kind of like do everything it also comes out and goes in which i forgot how to do that but this is the wheel she I will say has a uh, suede accents there are suede accents in this car on the seats here and then also I feel like I'm in an airplane but we have clean seats here you know in case you want to chill but I'm just like trying to think of interesting things but honestly uh you know it's a car <laughs> so it has basic things that everything has I guess of course like the controls and stuff is over here for the mirrors right here I think these are like for the sports gears also, one little thing, um, these lights are like touch, touch, and the, the little is touch sensitive as well. Uh, it also has like a thing where you could put it on and it tells you if you like are merging out of the lane. So it'll like give you a little beep. So it's kind of like lane assist autopilot, but without keeping you in the lane, it just is informing you if you go out of it. So yeah, let's hop in the back and we'll we'll do a little back tour to see what's happening, happening back there. Well, hello again. Hop in, hop in. Well, this is new for me. Anyways, um, so we have a little a little thing back here. I did not know these seats were also heated. Yeah, I didn't know that was happening back here. Uh, so they have the little thing, the little air circulation going on back here as well. We got some, some charger ports and it's USB right away. So this I think is amazing because honestly, not a lot of people carry car charger ports with them anymore, you may notice. So. Suede accents once again. Very nice back here. Uh, nice and roomy. We got the sunroof that peeps all the way back. This thing right here. Oh, I guess it's like a little compartment. I think these cool or something. I don't know. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm going crazy, but they, it feels ultra cold. Might just be the temperature in LA right now. And then this is like a little, I guess like a basic little thing going on. And the pockets. I mean, that's, I feel like pretty much it. There we go. We are gonna go look at the trunk now, um, and we're flying by. We're flying by. This is a quick video. I don't have much in this car, guys. But let's go on back. Let's go. Like I s Oh, man. This is <laughs> one of my other TikToks. That's what I want to be on, guys. Oh, my God. They're killing it. Um, beep, beep, beep. Of course, the little button. Here we go, everyone. Oh, this is great for a little drive-in movie night, per se, huh? Alex, what is this for? Does anybody oh, know? Oh, I'm not sure. Maybe, oh, to put like more stuff on. Anyways, uh, right here, the only thing I have back here is Stella's bed, which is usually in the front seat, but I wanted to move it 
so you guys can see it. It's like a car bed, so it goes over the seat, it buckles on it, you can buckle her leash on here, and she really loves it. Yeah, I mean, there's not much to show back here, guys. Another main reason I wanted, not even just a gas car, but an SUV car, is because... <laughs> I could not fit anything in my Tesla. Alex knows this, I have multiple stories of struggling to do anything with that Tesla. So if you guys are looking at Teslas, which I 100% support because electric cars, it's great. Like maybe look at the size up. Unfortunately, I could not afford an X. I had to do what I had to do. Uh, but long story short, I tried getting a 48 by 48 canvas in my car and it did not work. And then I went to a world market to get some art decor and it would not fit. And I broke the frame off of the art decor trying to squeeze it in here. But luckily, a man at world market offered to drive it to my place. That sounds scary but it was all it was all good this can fit big things if you guys watched my san diego vlog uh i had to fit my mac miller world faces uh canvas in here and it fit perfect so that is another thing that i love this space right here is big enough and i appreciate having room for 48 by 48 inch canvases <laughs> anyways there we go so um, I feel like that completes the video. There's not too many aspects to show like Miss Brittany the Tesla. She had car karaoke. She had Mario Kart. So yeah, di definitely different vibes. I also don't have Netflix in this car, but that's okay. That is fine. I love her just as much. Uh, I'm trying to think of other things that this car has. It has a functioning horn. Put it here. A functioning horn and then it also lifts. So for off-roading, if I were to like press this little lever right here, it lifts the car up. Yeah, I did that on accident one time. So, uh, yeah, I feel like, ah! I am so, so happy to, it's great. It feels wonderful and I love it. So I'm very, very grateful. But yeah, that pretty much sums up the car. Stay tuned for some clips of it getting wrapped. I'll probably put pictures in before and after and little video clips at West Coast Customs because they killed it. It was done in like a week's time and it looks amazing. I had a moment, you know, this is the dream manifestation, baby. I'm not gonna start with you guys. I'm not gonna start with you because I'll get too carried on. But thank you guys for stopping by. I really hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please smash that thumbs up and subscribe down below and don't forget to press that notification bell to get notified every time I upload and to become part of the notification squad hashtag Rose gang so that is all for today and I hope you guys like this video thanks for watching I love you so so much and I will see you in my next one bye Put it down. car we're gonna do deep satin black all the window trim all the roof is gonna be normal color all the molding is gonna look like glass it's gonna look amazing
dark window tint. So pretty much we're trying to match whatever factory they have in the back to do in the front so they can look even.